my name is Mary and I also go by the Healing Cave Lady and if you're new to my channel welcome. Today I'm going to talk about you know the kind of stuff that we've been dealing with lately in our country. I have to go into the workplace wearing masks constantly. I think it's really important to have some good information to keep yourself healthy. You know if you've had to be wearing masks for any reasons that they are not healthy especially to have on for periods between 8 and 12 hours at a time, let alone an hour at a time, is you're breathing in your own CO2. So your body, your brain, your cells need oxygen. Um, oxygen is very, very important to our body. It not only drives circulation and healing, but it tells our brain that we are safe. And when we are safe, that means we are not dropping hormones that cause us to be sent into fight or flight mode and to be dropping stress hormones and to cause our blood pressure to raise. Um, those things are not good, we know that. And some of us are going to be in situations where we're gonna have to be wearing masks more and I just wanna talk to you about some safety that you can be doing to take care of yourself. This is not medical information, please, or um, medical advice, please talk to your practitioner about any of these things before actually doing them. I wanted to throw that out there. So um, a lot of my clients have been contacting me and asking me what to do if they are in a situation where they have to wear a mask at work in the workplace. And I think it's very, very important to know, <laughs> for one, your oxygen levels. Um, and make sure you are getting adequate time with the mask off where you can go outside and breathe fresh air and get oxygen into your body so that your body is not in a stress state. If your body is in a stress state, your immune system gets lower down and you're more likely to catch viruses if you are constantly stressed. And even if you don't feel stressed, once you put that mask on, your body perceives that it is stressed because it's not getting the oxygen that it needs. So um, one thing to have on hand while you're at the workplace would be a really good idea to get a pulse ox meter. I got this one on Amazon for about $22 or so. You can read your oxygen absorption at any time. I believe it also gives a heart rate. You just turn it on and snap it onto your finger and it's battery operated. And the battery actually lasts a really long time. I bought this a few months ago and every time I turn it on, it works. So right now I'm at uh, 97% for oxygen absorption and anything below a 93 gets into a dangerous area. So um, you're gonna wanna check yourself every few hours if you are at a check stand or if you're at some, a desk where you're sitting down, really, really important to make sure you're getting adequate oxygen absorption and making sure that you check in on this. So I'll put a link in this in the description box below. Um, this is a really highly rated brand. So really important to have one of these at your desk or your check stand or wherever you're at to keep make sure your oxygen levels are good. So when you have that mask on all day, you are recirculating whatever is in your nasal cavity, whatever microbes that you are breathing out are actually in a state of where they're going to be breathing there. Um, obviously that's why it's really important to wash your masks or use disposable masks. You can't control what is recirculating in the nose, in the sinuses, in the lungs by rebreathing in all of those microbes. Your lungs are an expellatory organ where they're trying to get toxins and um, pathogens out. So by rebreathing those things in, it's gonna cause those things to breed. Um, I have found this little combination to be absolutely magical. Ever since um, the C word hit, <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? Um, I have been doing this as long as well as my whole entire family just to keep our lungs clear and safe. So what we do is we take this silver biotics, parts per million, so it's nice and low, not too high, and we take this, this specific product is guaranteed to leave your body within 24 hours of using it. Know that any other company has been tested or have done the clinical tests to make sure that it leaves the body. And that's why this silver will not turn you blue and you're not gonna have any issues um, uh, retaining any of the metals, um, but it's basically a micronized silver, which kills pathogens, viruses, bacteria, fungi, mold, able to kill everything and keep everything draining. Anything that you might get caught up in there isn't going to fester and start to grow. So if you are, you know, you got mold, you've got viruses, you've got bacteria, all breeding in here. Once you take it off, what you can do is you can take a little portable nebulizer. Um, the best price I found on this is in, on eBay. They're like 22 bucks. Um, they ship from California, so I got them very quickly. I actually bought like five of these. I bought one for everybody in the family. What you can do is you can take 
you know, about two milliliters, two to five milliliters of the colloidal silver. And if you wanna take it one step further, what you can do is add something called biomolecular oxygen. Um, I will show you at the end how to sign up for an account so you can get a discount on this product. Um, bio biomolecular oxygen helps your body with oxygenation. It helps the lungs um, get oxygen on a cellular level and it will actually, you will be able to see a difference from when you start nebulizing the biomolecular oxygen on your pulse ox meter, it works so good. So it's gonna help deliver intense oxygen to the lungs. So it's not gonna be sending you off into that fight or flight mode all the time. So I think these are probably gonna be some of the most important things to have in your toolkit. So what you do is you put the silver in there and it only takes about two or three drops of the biomolecular oxygen. It's very, very concentrated. And this product is insane. Um, so you drop that into your nebulizer and this is what I do. I just turn it on and I breathe it in. So as you can see, it's misting and you put it over your mouth and your nose. So you're supposed to breathe it in and hold it for 10 seconds. I take turns between breathing from my mouth and my nostrils. So I'll either breathe in for 10 seconds in the mouth, hold into the lungs, it can cause coughing, um, it's good to practice this at home because you'll get used to it. Um, it can cause some coughing because you're not used to kind of taking in liquids into the lungs, but it's actually gonna help oxygenate the lungs, kill um, bacteria, viruses, mold, like I said, and keep the nose draining. So that little bit of moisture in there because it is so antibacterial, antimicrobial, it's gonna help kill all those things, but it's also gonna keep the nose draining. You'll notice you'll have to blow your nose a little bit more often right after you do it going to drain all the stuff out that is trapped in the nose hair causing issues and and possibly con causing sinus issues you're going to see a huge uptick in sinus infections wearing these masks because you are trapping all of the pathogens and mold and dust and all those things all these pollen it's getting trapped in the sinuses and it's not draining this is going to help so much so during the day um, if you have breaks you can run outside do some breathing and really get that extra oxygen that your body needs, kill anything that might have gotten trapped in there, and um, be able to preventively drain, get everything out of your system. So I think this is going to be honestly one of the most important combinations for people through cold and flu season in the fall, because if you can address all of these things, all of these pathogens, all of the things that are going to be getting trapped in the masks before they have time to proliferate you are going to be one step ahead of getting sick. You know, it's very, very preventative. So, and the oxygen, I mean, you will notice, so many people notice a difference in their oxygen, even readably on their pulse ox. They'll take the mask off, do some breathing, check their pulse ox, and their oxygen levels will go up so quickly. It's crazy. Um, this is also really great for people who live in high altitudes and have issues getting oxygen. 10 seconds alternate with the nose. Maybe you do it for a minute or two. Maybe you only have 15 seconds to do it. It's going to be so much better than not doing it. To kind of kill things and nip things in the bud right off the bat. Super, super, super important. And if God forbid you come down with the C word, then you've got something right off the bat. Um, our, uh, our pediatrician, Dr. Paul Thomas, actually advised us to have uh, silver, colloidal silver and nebulizers on hand if they come down with a C word to help kill the bacteria, kill viruses and get it out of the body. So it also breaks up mucus and thinks, keeps things draining. So that was actually um, sent out in an email from our doctor to do if any of the kids came down with anything. Like I said, not medical advice, that came from my doctor. He sent out an email to all of his patients saying that it's a good idea to have these on hand for, you know, the C word virus. You know what I'm talking about? Doing it preventatively, I think is going to be super, super important to keep ourselves healthy. That's all you wanted to know today. That's great. Have a wonderful day. Thank you for watching. Please share this video. I think the information is very, very important. Um, but also, if you want to go one step further and protect your lungs, I think it's important to take products that have respiratory support. So glutathione recycler from Apex Energetics. This is one that I've been taking ever since the C word hit. It has a high dose, 40 micrograms of selenium, 
but it also has N-acetylcysteine, it has milk thistle extract, L-glutamine, alpha lipoic acid, and some other extracts to help not only the immune system, but help your body create the master antioxidant, glutathione. Tox get all of the toxins out of the body. It also, glutathione is a biofilm buster. It busts up the biofilms that pathogens can attach to and helps rinse them out of the body. But you also have the support for your lungs by having the N-acetylcysteine, which a lot of people call NAP. In fact, I take one of these every day with lunch. Um, the other thing I take is called the One Multivitamin. So the One Multivitamin has 25 milligrams of zinc in it, but also selenium, it has vitamins A, C, D, E, niacin, B6, folate, B12, biotin. It also has um, some coenzyme Q10, alpha lipoic acid, and a bunch of other trace minerals. It is my absolute favorite multivitamin and you only need to take one, which is great, especially for those of you that have a sensitive stomach. So these are things that I'm doing to kind of safeguard myself and my family. Um, I even have my kids that can swallow pills on the one multivitamin as well as glutathione recycler just to keep their respiratory support good. And we all nebulize morning and evening. My kids think it's really funny and fun to do. It's going to clear out all the sinuses, everything that we breathe in at night. So clear all of those pathogens and, um, and microbes and things like that out and keep things draining. I think it's so important to keep things draining, keep oxygen levels up and kill any type of things that um, might cause issues if they fester. About nebulizing the silver is this specific silver has been tested and it doesn't kill um, the good bacteria like the lactobacillus. So I think things that just kill everything and this does not affect the lactobacillus strains of the good probiotics. So you're not robbing Peter to pay Paul, which is totally awesome. I'm not into sterilizing things. I hate that. So please leave any questions in the description box below. Make sure you share this with anybody that has to be wearing masks all the time, or maybe is that is even in the health industry where they have to stay healthy to keep other people's healthy. And we thank you so much for doing what you do. If you do that, I'm super appreciative to all the healthcare workers. So um, I hope you have a wonderful day. Check out how to order all these things in the description box below. I personally ship really fast things out to you really fast and um, so that you can have it to stay healthy. So have a wonderful day. Thanks for watching. Bye.